Yo, what up everybody? Cardboard Moses in the house. Time to get more personal. Four boxes of Donruss baseball. Personals. Let's uh, go ahead and knock that out right now. Otani. All right. Your son made that bright. Exactly. Oh, you know, my son, you know, made that bid. Oh, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's a company account and... I don't want my boss to find out. Oh, you know. You you would you would be surprised. You would be surprised. I demand Otani to come out. The power of cardboard Moses compels you. It's it's always entertaining to see the uh the excuses they give. Like, I'd, I'd rather not even, like, they give me excuses. I'd rather they just straight up tell me, like, yo, I fucked up, boom. I would have more respect for you if you, if you just did that. As opposed to giving me a whole sob story. Well, it was for Spectra Basketball. And he was all like, oh, man, you know, I bid by mistake. You know, I didn't mean to bid that much, blah, blah, blah. And then I check, and he didn't even win the bid. So all's well that ends well on, on that one. What up, Chris? How are you, my dude? You say you picked up the Pistons? My boy picked up the pistons in uh in the optic break. Indeed he did. My man Chris. Appreciate you, man. We're one step closer to breaking, baby. That might that might feel tonight. It it is it is what it is, K Daisy. It is what it is. You know you gotta take the good with the bad. Well, see, now, Ryan, that's a different story. Like, 3K, that's, you know, that's that's a good amount of money. But, you know, I have people crying over $3. You know, that's like, you know, I understand it's the principle, but, I mean, really? Blast, see, I did not know that because I, I don't, you know, I don't really deal with eBay, to be honest. So you can, you know, the buyer can retract the bid 12 hours before the item ends. See, that, see, that's, that can work, but not really for this. Because, you know, we'll, we'll have things that, you know, for example, I have a listing that was over at 430, but it's going to break at 7 o'clock. You know what I mean? Draft football. Uh, what is this? I just did optic basketball. James, I thought you were going to sleep, man. All right, let's uh, finally get this popping. Otani! Let's go. Good luck, Ryan. Let's see what we get. For the Astros to 498, Carlos Correa. Don't worry, I'll get all that stuff sleeved up for you uh, afterward. Tyler Frank, American Pride to 999. 
All the variations and all that other stuff, of course, would also be uh, sleeved up and taken care of. Alrighty, come on. Well, there's an Otani to 999. The Mount Marvel uh, insert. I'm gonna top load that because that's probably that's probably like five bucks right there on eBay right now. Maybe even more. I don't know. That boy's been crushing it. We have Andrew Stevenson autograph for the Nationals. I appreciate that, right? I appreciate that. We 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 aim to please. We aim to please. In the five ten dollar range for a card number to nine nine nine, that's not too bad. Rafael Davers with the handkerchief for the Red Sox. Not 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 cool that they have like cards facing one direction and the other one like the other direction. What product is that from Blast? Yeah, Otani's been crushing it, man, which is awesome for the hobby. And good for him, too, shit. You know, everybody was down in the dumps with uh, about him because he wasn't doing too good in spring training. But my boy's been killing it. Adam Jones to 189. Orioles. Got an Altuve to 249 Astros. Anthony Rizzo to 99 for the Cubs. To 999, Justin Smoke. Blue Jays. Alright, we got a patch up here. For the Twins, Tyler Duffy. Sobered up, so I'm up now. Well, you, you know, the best way is to just, just keep on drinking. Benintendi to 49 for the Red Sox. Don't listen to me. I'm just a bad influence. Zach Colzart to 99. Angels. Where's the Otani at? Dang it. Otani with some ink. All right. We got three more shots at this thing. Needs three more shots at this thing. Need something huge for my boy here. Gotta stay on top of those messages, man. Alright, that's not a big deal. Oh man, Kanko man. Kanko man, if you watching us, I, I see you pimping. I see you. My boy scooping up them Lakers in the optic full caser. I see you, Kanko Man. I mean, I'll tell you what, Chris. It's 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 one of those things where it's it's kind of like a double-edged sword. You know, it's it's great for bringing in new people and just people in general. But you know, when that happens, then you got to deal with the negative, which is dealing with people. <laughs> and more often than that, 
you know, people are, for the most part, selfish and want everything done their way and, you know, expect you to bend yourself over backwards and blah, blah, blah. And you know what they say, you know, the customer's always right. And that's, that's kind of what it is when it comes to retail and sales and things of that nature. Yeah, you see what I mean? We found, we, we found hella new customers. Ryan, James, for example. You know what I mean? So, they're, they're, it does have its, its pluses. But just like any other thing in the world, you know, it also comes with its negatives. But, uh, but I mean, it's, it's cool. It's cool by me. And just like Blast says, it, it really shows you how dirty people can act and, uh, and whatnot. But, you know, like I said, you got to take the good with the bad. I can definitely say that eBay has done far, far more good than it has bad. It's just that, you know, I get easily annoyed. And when that happens... I gotta let everybody know. <laughs> See, there you go, right? That's 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 what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to be everybody's like personal little breaker. Make this a, a nice big old happy breaking family. You dig? Let me uh, let me hit my boy up real quick here. Really? You can't I'm about to say Boom. All right, here we go. There you go, Ryan. You got to like, got to like nice things. I don't know. You know, for me, the, the one thing that I can think of as far as like, you know, because nowadays... You know, case breaking, box breaking, it's it's still a relatively new thing. But it's it's been around now for I wanna say five to anywhere from five to eight years. Um so a lot of people still finding out about it and whatnot. And one thing I've noticed as far as you know, this is concerned is you know, people are extremely loyal. You know what I mean? So once you find the breaker you like you more or less stick around with them and you don't really, you know, go anywhere else to, to get your breaking done. Um, so at that point, you know, what, what separates one breaker from the next? Well, you know, of course, there's prices and, you know, giveaways or whatever. But aside from that, your personality and who you are and the way, you know, you treat people and whatnot. So I, I, I try to, you know, be as as nice as possible to people and, and understanding and whatnot and just provide the best customer service possible while at the same time being good old sarcastic asshole jesse you know uh anyway to 189 phillies odubel herrera uh yeah no problem ryan i mean i got dude i got you see that wall back there like from from where my finger is to the right that's all dummy cards i got drawers full of that shit so I have I have no problem sending you dummy cards. Let me know how many you want, bro, and I'll send them to you. Chris Sale, Red Sox pitcher. I appreciate that, Chris. Flattery will get you everywhere. That's, you know, that's one thing that I try to, like, do. Uh, I'm not... I, I could care less about... You know, being politically correct. I'm going to give you my opinion 100% raw every time. Some people like that. Some people don't. So, you know, I'm not I'm not for everybody. I'm not for everybody. Uh, with that being said, this is a nice card. I just wish it was numbered. Ozzy Albies of the Braves. Top prospect. That's a good card. 
That's a good card. Not only that, but I've also been starting to learn my baseball now. I've been watching baseball, keeping my eye and my ear to the streets of uh, who's good, up and coming, and whatnot. Like this guy, Aaron Judge, with the handkerchief for the Yankees. What else we got? Oh, dude, Ryan, it's it's not not a problem, bro. You give me a number, and I'll take care of you. You take care of me, uh, Ryan, I take care of you. That's, you know, my mom raised me that way. You know, treat others you the way you would like to be treated. And at the end of the day, man, you're, you're putting money in my pocket, bro. You're helping me pay bills. You know, so the least I could do is send you some of these if you want them. You know, you treat me good, I'm going to treat you even better. Um, I'm a huge proponent of karma. Or, I don't I don't think I used that word properly. Anyway. Uh, Jose Peraza. With the napkin for the Reds. Allen and Ginter is a funky, funky product, James. Uh, to 249, Aaron Judge, Yankees. They, you know, there's 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 non baseball cards in there, so uh, it's 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 a funky product, man. The best thing I can do or I could say is look at the checklist just so you can get an idea of what's in there. Uh, do a quick Google search as well, James. Uh, to one eighty nine, Buster Posey Giants. Uh, but there there's things uh like there for example there's this thing called uh, rip cards in Allen and Ginter where uh, all right, let's say we have this card, right? Now, on the front, it just pretend that there's no patch here, right? Like, it's a thick card, and it's like, oh, you got, you know, pretend, oh, this is a Jose Peraza in the front. But there's, like, a sticker to it where you could peel the sticker, and then there'll be, like, an other card inside of it. Uh, you know, which is usually, like, like, a mini card. The mini cards are, you know, they could be autographed. They could be super short printed. They could be extremely rare, like one of ones, where the only way you can get it is if you actually rip the card, uh, which is insane. You know, it, you could potentially like for I've had people have like, oh, it's an Aaron Judge rip card, rookie card, which is sick. But what's behind it? You know what I mean? It could be, it could be something even better than that. So it's really one of those products that you really got to research. You know, there's celebrities, there's uh, non MOB athletes, there's you know wooden cards, metal cards, uh, you know the minis. It's it's a it's a crazy crazy product. All right, Ryan, I'll, I'll hook you up with a little some some, uh, just like this Shohei Otani to nine nine nine, Dominator. Need to start seeing some ink for this man. Yeah, Allen and Ginter is a funky product. It's, it's pretty dope. To 189, Adam Wainwright Cardinals. Well, they, that's, that's the thing about it, James. You know, I've heard many horror stories. Uh concerning rip cards but I've also heard some stories that are quite frankly unbelievable so 500 Dominic Smith Yankees like I had I had a dude that had a Aaron Judge rookie card it was a rip card you know he could have he could he probably could have he probably could have sold it on eBay for like 300 bucks or something like that I think that's what it was going for at the time he's he was like fuck it I'm gonna rip it and inside was a, a, a mini Mickey Mantle 101 autograph. It was ridiculous. You know, I've had, I've had other stories where it's a rip card of like Ben and Tandy in the front, rookie card, and then underneath that is a, a 101 Sandy Koufax. Those are some of the good stories. You, you don't want to hear the bad ones. The 257 Joey Votto Reds.
So it's it's one of it's one of those products that like if you really like gambling, Allen and Ginter will either break your heart in a million tiny little pieces, or it might just pay for like your mortgage for the month or something. Yeah, a lot of people try to sell the card, you know, unripped for that appeal. You know, I've had, I've even heard stories of people trying to like use x-ray machines or whatever the fuck, infrared or whatever, like ultraviolet light or something, trying to like see what's inside the rip card, which can damage the card somewhat. So I wouldn't suggest doing that. Right, that's another one. You can use a magnet to see if the, the card inside is metal. It's like, man, there there's all types of uh, craziness. Well, James, funny enough, if you go to our YouTube channel and uh, go to our videos and type in the search Allen and Ginter, you'll, you you can find a couple videos. You know, Allen and Ginter, I did, a, did a, a case of it last year, so you can see some of the stuff if you're interested. Of course, every year, you know, the the, the hits vary, so you, you do need to do your research, uh, you know, via the checklist. Alright, somebody just went balls deep in the store. The Lakers are gone, the Jazz are gone, and the Celtics are gone in Optic Basketball. Bulls, Hornets, Knicks, Sixers, Warriors are available. I can remember the good days of Wayne Packs at Walmart. Hey. How much for the Hornets and Optic? The Hornets are 44 bucks, Blast. Ah, oh, Chris, no worries, man. All caps means you are excited. Or you, you, you clicked on it by mistake. Or your keyboard is just stuck on the all caps. Uh, let's see, we have the Bulls left, Bulls are 74, the Hornets 44, Knicks 49, Sixers 129, and the Warriors 69, giggity. So there's still some big teams left, six, uh, sorry, five teams left to be exact. So uh, let's, let's, let's get some mojo going in on that optic. Box three time. Otani! Come out with ink. Alright, what do we have though? Got a Scherzer. 10999 Nationals. Got a Molina. Yadier Molina for the Cardinals autograph. Decent. Sure hope so, Chris. My boy deserves it. Make it in Otani. We got Orlando Arcia. Napkin for the Brewers. We have Eric Gonzalez. 
napkin to 99 for the Indians. We have Nolan Arenado to 349 Rockies. We got Buster Posey to 49 Giants. Come on, baby. Something huge from a boy. All right, we got Will Myers to 99 from the Padres. Cody Ballinger to 352 Dodgers. Give me some ink, big time ink. We got Clint Kershaw to 999 Dodgers. Got a gold American pride. For Jeremy Earman, number to ninety-nine. All right, time for the last box. Get this out the way. Somebody picked up the Bulls just now. Shout outs to Chris. Now we are at four left. Last box mojo. Otani autograph coming right now. Right now. I have no doubts. Sometimes you got to, Chris. Sometimes you got to. All right, here we go. Otani! Time to hit another dinger. Here we go. So, we have George Brett to 199 for the Royals. Uh, 
to 999 Grand Koch, the American Pride. We have to 239, Jacob DeGrom, Mets. To 349, Buster Posey, Giants. Not bad. Jose Abreu for the White Sox autograph. Boom. Need another boom. Need an Otani boom. Tim Tebow with a little boom. Two color uh, uh, pinstripe patch for the Mets there. To nine nine nine, Joey Gallo, Rangers. Benintendi, Red Sox to three fifty three. Mike Trout to nine nine nine, Angels. To forty nine, the World Champs, Astros. Uh, insert. Patch for Braden Shipley of the D backs. Last stack mojo, come on, baby. Mickey Mantle to 199. Corey Seeger to 500. Dodgers. And dang it, I am a failure. Sorry, Ryan. I could not hold up my end of the bargain and hit the Otani for you. I will commit seppuku! Uh, before I do that, though, let me recap your uh, your autographs. Least I can do for you. Uh, did get some Otani uh, parallels, though. Mount Marvel to 999. Uh, and the Dominator to 999. And decent ink, Jose Abreu, White Sox, Yadier Molina, Cardinals, Ozzy Albies, Braves, and Andrew Stevenson, Nationals. And that was the break, uh, Ryan. Appreciate you, man. Four personal boxes of Donruss Baseball coming your way. And I'll shoot you, uh, shoot you a few dozen uh, jumbo cards, or I should say dummy cards, too, man. Thank you very much. We'll get this out to you, baby.